This is an overview of the Bark AI text to speech. So um, there are two ways to use it. One is through the Hug and Face site, and then the other is through the Collabs. So I'm going to start with the Hug and Face. Okay, so that one, we'll just take a sentence here and then go back. All right, so this is where you put the text. So it says input text. I'm just copy what I did. So it's one, two, and then I put the dash, the quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog, and I want to make it laugh. That's funny. I want it to clear its throat, I guess. I want it to sigh, and then what else do you suggest? So if you go down further on the site, it will explain to you what the non-speech sounds how to use them so you'll see here some of the stuff that i have added it was from here so the dash was for hesitation and then the other stuff was for the other non-speech sounds okay so when you go to the acoustic prompt you'll see here unconditional this one i've noticed it's random so if i don't have an idea of what I want it to sound like, I go for the unconditional. So I've tried all the English speakers. I will follow up with the samples from each of those at the end of this video. But for now, let's pick uh, maybe speaker five and then just to run it to show you. Okay, so I just have to click run. We'll see. Oh, see, this is long. All right. So this is how it's done in the Huggin face space. So because I see the queue is so long, I'm actually just going to go right off and go back to the collab. All right, so we're going to abandon this one. As you can see, um, it's like 20 in the queue. And this time, sometimes it goes past it. So yeah, we want to skip that. Okay, so this one is the... Collab, you can get there from the GitHub site, and there's the opening spaces and the opening collab. You just have to select opening collab, and you're going to need to sign in to your Google account. Okay, so I've signed into my Google account, and now what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy to Drive. Okay, so it opens up this new page. All right, so I just go straight into it and I just say execute, oh, um, run in English. Okay, so it's going to be, I just go and select run all. It's connecting over here. And it's going to install all this. So you'll see there's the basic. So that was what was installed in Hugging Face. Face. And then the advanced. We'll do the basic and the advanced. Okay, so that has finished. So I'll let you have a look through. Okay, so we have a green check mark. So that's good. On the basics as well. Okay, so we'll start with this one here. All right, so if I go back, I think it should probably still be copied, but I'll redo it anyway. Okay, so I'm going to replace this sentence here in red with what I wrote. Okay, so I'm gonna paste mine in, and then I'm going to on this again just this particular one so you do have to when you change the script um you do have to run it before you do the play okay so now that has run i'm just gonna hit play to see what it sounds like 
one, two. The quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. <laughs> That's funny. <clears throat> I guess. <sighs> what else do you suggest? Okay, so that was a random one. Okay, so now let's try it again with the advanced examples. So I want to take this one here. Because this one here, you'll see here, it has the speakers. So I'm going to replace this one here. I'm going to paste in that previous example, the one to the quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. And here I'm going to change the speaker from that same list that was in the hug and face. Um, I think I had said five. So let's try five. And then again, run this. So I've actually already used this to make a video and I really liked the default. It was like so natural sound and it was pretty cool. So, and the reason I picked this uh, text was just to try and get as much variation in the way it spoke and the also those non-verbal communications as well. Okay, so now let's play and see what happens. One, two, the quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. That's fine. Mm -hmm. I guess. What else do you suggest? Okay, so I was going to say I missed that part, but in the end it did do it. Let me see if I can up the volume just to have it a bit more. Okay, let's One, try. two. The quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. That's funny. Mm -hmm. I guess. What else do you suggest? Okay, and so that's it. Okay, so one thing I did forget to mention here is if you want to download, um, just click on the three little dots. And sorry again, it's uh, it's in French, so it's going to be download. Will probably will probably be the same, but just in English. So I'll just click that, and then you see it's downloaded. One, two, the quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> I guess. <sighs> What else do you suggest? One, two, the quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. <laughs> That's funny. I guess. What else do you suggest? One, two, the quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, uh. What else do you suggest? One, two, the quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. It's funny. Uh, I guess. What else do you suggest? One. Two. The quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. It's funny. Uh, I guess. What else do you suggest? Uh, one. Two. The quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. <laughs> That's funny. Um, and I guess, uh, what else do you suggest? One, two, the quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. <laughs> uh, that's funny. <clears throat> I guess. Uh, what else do you suggest? Two, the quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. <laughs> that's funny. Um, I guess. Ah, oh, what else do you suggest? One, two, the quick brown fox jumps over the ravey dog. <laughs> it's funny, I guess. What else do you suggest? One, two, the quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. <laughs> That's funny, <clears throat> I guess. What else do you suggest? And one, two, the quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. Hmm. <laughs> That's funny. <clears throat> I guess. What else do you suggest?